In this video, I want to show you how to quickly and easily scan a document from the dot loop app into your loop. First, you want to make sure that you open the loop that you want the document scanned into and be sure to click documents. From here, we're going to click the plus sign next to documents and you're going to choose the option scan a document. Now, while you have that image of the document, make sure your lighting is good. And then in the lower corner, you're going to see that little circle with an X in it. Surprisingly, that's the actual camera icon. So I'm going to tap there to take the first image. And if it was more than one image, you can just keep tapping it a few times if it's several pages. Nice and easy. So next, I'm going to hit done. And this is going to open the editing tools. When you are here, I first recommend that you do crop so that you can then go ahead and drag this down to fit into the right size that you need it for that document. So I've got it there. Okay, I'm gonna hit okay on that. I can then do adjustments so I can make it brighter or darker if I need to. Adjust the brightness some. That's gonna change if it's black and white or color. So I'm okay with the black and white. You can even draw on it if you need to. All kinds of extra controls here. I'm gonna hit okay on that. So if I wanted to draw something, I could, but we're going to uh, not wanna do that. Back button. And then I hit next for the next page, crop that one as well. So you can see you can do this pretty easily. Okay. I can go ahead and do my adjustments, make that black and white, and brighten it up a little bit. Next one, and the third page, which is actually all the same page, but three images. So it's a simple editing tool, but I just want to show you that it is possible to do this. Adjustments, make it black and white, give it a little brightness. Next, and now it's done, and I'm going to name it something, so we'll call this test document. Okay, where do I want this? I'll put it into the test document, uh, select the folder. I want it in test one, hit the back button and then save. Now you'll notice I have a test document that's a PDF and I have everything I need scanned in here as three pages with the ability to now actually do some controls from adding signature boxes if I need to, add signatures, I can add text if I need to, add a text box or strike through text box. It is your full ability to get that document in there. All right. Thanks so much for watching. If you enjoyed this video, give it a like. Leave me a comment below. I'd love to hear from you and follow me on KB Connect today.